liberal viewer present. So, I saw a lot of bad speculation in the media this week about Senator Tim Johnson's supposed stroke that turned out to actually be an arteriovenous malformation. But one of the most interesting clips I saw was the non-comment from outgoing Republican Senate Majority Leader Bill Frist shown here. Outgoing Senate Majority Leader Bill Frist, a former heart and lung transplant surgeon, visited Johnson late Thursday and upon leaving the hospital said this. I'm not going to make any comment uh, at all, uh, but uh, very, very pleased with the progress. And that's really it. But thank you all. Senator, Appreciate it. I can go right that way. Is he conscious? Is he conscious? Thank you. Now, it's very interesting that Senator Frist was unable to even comment as to whether Senator Johnson was conscious when Senator Frist so famously made this medical judgment based only on videotape last year. I've looked at the video footage based on the footage provided me, which were part of the facts of the case. She does respond. Now, regarding that last clip, my wife, the doctor, wanted me to ask, should a heart and lung surgeon with no specialty training or certifications in neurology or neurosurgery really be making medical judgments regarding neurological conditions? And, regarding both the clips together, I have to ask, why was Senator Frist unable to comment even on Senator Johnson's consciousness after seeing him in person when he was able to tell us so much about Terry Schiavo just by watching her on video? I YouTube, you decide.